there, busy kids. We are nearing the end of our first module in level 3B. We're going to be talking about the A melodic minor scale today. So you may recall from level 3A, if you did level 3A in my program, that we talked about natural and harmonic minor scales. And I'm going to review what those are with you if it's sounding a little foggy or unfamiliar to you. But today we're going to build on our knowledge of that and talk about the melodic minor scale. It's a little bit different. It might be a little bit strange. We change things around a little bit. There are intervals within the melodic minor scale that are used a lot in jazz music. So that's kind of where this scale comes from. But let's take a closer look and review some of our minor scales and then I'll explain to you what a melodic minor scale is. So the first thing we're going to want to do is figure out what the key signature is going to be for a natural minor scale. And I think the easiest way to do that is to think about our relative major. So if I want to find the relative major for A minor, I go up three half steps. One, two, three. What key is this? If you said C, you're correct. So C and A are relatives. That means they're going to have the same key signature. Do you remember if there's any sharps or flats in the key of C major? If you said there's no sharps and flats, you're correct. So that also means that A natural minor, the key signature, will have no sharps and flats. So let's take a look at my big board here. I wanted to show you a little bit longer than what I can typically show you on my tin sheet. So I'm using this big old marker board to show you. And this I've written out is the A natural minor scale in the treble clef. Ascending, going up, and descending, going down. So let's go ahead and name the notes in the natural minor scale. Natural minor means that it's going to follow the key signature and there's no sharps or flats in my key signature and no sharps or flats in my scale. So let's go ahead and name these notes. Ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, A, G, F, E, D, C, B, A. So that's the natural minor scale. Now do you remember what we do for the harmonic minor scale? We're going to raise the seventh note of the scale for our harmonic minor scale. So let's look here. What's the seventh note of our scale? If you said G, you're correct. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now to raise that note, if I look over here on my keyboard, if I want to raise the G a half step, what key would this be called here? If you said G sharp, you're correct. So all I need to do to turn this into harmonic is to put a sharp in front of my G. And you can do it again over here. So now I have the harmonic minor scale, which has the seventh note raised. Now, as I said, we're going to be talking about the melodic minor scale, which is a little bit confusing because the ascending scale, the scale going up, is different from the descending scale, the scale going down. So my ascending scale, I'm going to keep my seventh raised, just like in the harmonic, but I'm also going to raise the sixth note. So I'm going to raise F to F sharp. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. My sixth and my seventh are raised. Now on the descent, the way going down, I'm going to go back to a natural minor scale or the scale that follows the key signature. My key signature is no sharps and no flats. So if I look over here, that means these need to be natural. So the natural sign looks like this. Whoops, <laughs> I made mine a little long there. So it's kind of like an L and a seven put together. And this is gonna cancel a sharper flat. So I'm gonna put a natural sign, squeeze it in here on my G and my F so that you can see on the way up, my sixth and seventh are raised. And then on the way down, I've lowered them. I'm playing the A natural minor scale. Let's take a look at these scales on our Let's key. start by looking at the treble clef of the A melodic minor scale, starting with finger one on A. It's going to be the same fingering as in our other minor scales. 
but we'll want to be careful for the sharps, the accidentals, all that good stuff. Accidentals are another name for sharps, flats, or naturals. So let's go ahead and start on A. B, C, tuck the thumb under. And now when we get to F, be sure you're raising that a half step and raising the G a half step to G sharp. Good. Now on our way down, we're gonna to return to our A natural minor scale with no sharps. So we start on A, G, F, E, D, cross finger three over to C, B, A. Very nice. So taking a look at our left hand now, again the same fingering, raising the sixth and seventh on the way up, and then playing the A natural minor scale on the way down. So we start on finger five, A, B, C, D, E, cross over to F sharp, G sharp, and then A. Now we're gonna go back to our A minor scale on the way down, natural minor. Ready, go. A, G, F, E, D, C, B, A. Very nice. Now we're gonna play an A minor scale accompaniment just the way we did when we did our C major scale accompaniment. Let's take a moment to go over the left hand here. We're gonna be starting with a broken one chord and then you're gonna to move to the five seven chord. Let's try that together. Ready, go. Moving to the five seven chord. Good, then in measure three, we move back to our one chord. And then we move to the four chord. So reach the finger one up to F. Can you try measures three and four with me? Ready, go. Let's take a look at measure five now. Broken one chord. And let's try to go all the way through the end. So we're playing broken one, broken four, broken five, seven, broken one. So starting measure five, second line through the end. Ready, go. One, two, three, four. One, two, five, seven chord. And then back to the broken one chord. right hand is doing is it's playing the A harmonic minor scale. So you'll notice when you get to G sharp, when we get to G actually, we've raised it to G sharp because it's raised seventh for the harmonic scale. You can pause the video and practice this a little bit extra going slowly until you feel comfortable. I'm going to go ahead and play the A minor scale accompaniment for you now. <laughs> 